Hey everyone, this is Just a Tech, your right to repair guy, and I welcome you all to my YouTube channel. So, Apple finally released the iOS 18.0 for all the supported devices. There are lots of new features that are released with this update. So, let me know your thoughts on this new update in the comment section. Now, let's talk about today's video session. So, in today's video, we will see the latest Bell Rain update that support the iOS 18. Yes, you are right, there are still a hope for one single iPad that support the iOS 18 with the Pelerin jailbreak support that is the iPad 7 generation but other iPads like iPad Pro M4 chipset, iPad Pro 12.9 third gen and up, iPad Pro 11 first gen and up, iPad Air M2, iPad Air 3rd Gen and up and iPad Mini 5th Gen and later. These models are not supported with the Pelerin jailbreak. Even if you see the iPhone that is the iPhone XS to iPhone 16 Pro Max, those are also not supported with the Pelerin jailbreak. So the only iPad that is the iPad 7 generation is supported with the Pelerin jailbreak iOS 18 update. So if you have this model, you are lucky. You can still use Pelerin to jailbreak your iPad. So currently I am running on the iPad OS 17.7 this is also the latest version for this iPad and if you go down you will see the latest iPad OS 18.0 for this model so I will update it in a minute but before that let me just show you the Pelerin official website so you can download the latest version from their official website or from the github page and obviously you will require a Mac system or if you are a Linux user you can use the Linux build and if you are a Windows user I will make the separate dedicated video on that or you can use the custom ISO file for the same for the download links you can check out the description let me just show you first the github page if you scroll it down you will get all the important information regarding this spell range jailbreak for the iPhones older iPhones that is the iPhone 6s to iPhone X are supported and for the iPad from the iPad Air 2 iPad mini 4 iPad 5th and 6th generation iPad 7 generation iPad Pro 9.7 and iPad Pro 12.9 first and second generation are supported along with that ipod 7 generation and apple tv hd and apple tv 4k first generation and the only ipad that is the ipad 7 generation are getting the ios 18 official update from the apple so we will download the latest version at the moment that is the version 2.0.1 you can check out the change log. This update was released on the 10th of August, but it still support the iOS 18 as well as for the iOS 15 and 16. iOS 18 betas I have tested. iOS 18.0 official update are supported. But if you see iOS 18.1 beta 4 at the moment with this version 2.0.1, there are some issues and it is not supported. So wait for the official Pelrain new version update so that in the future, if the 18.1 or any beta release, it will support there and if you scroll it down you will see the different builds for the mac os or the linux with a different architecture like intel mac silicon max arm 64 or intel x86 64 so you can download accordingly but if you are unaware about the build version which one to use on your system just see this direct download links this is available for mac os and linux and for other system you can download the custom iso file that i will make the further dedicated video on my channel so stay tuned for that so for the mac i will just copy this link it is more easy just copy the link and paste it on the terminal and just install it let me just show you now hit on enter now just enter your macbook password after that you can see it's installed direct one click link so it's more easy and fast way now let me just clear the terminal Alright now to run the Pelrain, just type Pelrain and hit on enter and it will open in the terminal. Now this way you don't have to install the Pelrain or enter the command and again and again. It's already installed it on your system. So you just need to run the Pelrain on the terminal and you are good. Now next you will see it will ask you to please specify rootful or rootless mode. Now if you want to jailbreak in the rootful mode, you have to mention Pelrain-F for the rootful and for the rootless you have to mention Pelrain-L 
So these two boot arguments help you to jailbreak in the rootful or rootless way. For this video, I'm only showing you the rootless mode. But if you want rootful mode video, just write down in the comment and I will make the dedicated video for that. And also if you need Windows method for the same, write down in the comments. So now let's proceed further. So I will use the Pelrin rootless mode so let me just connect my ipad and show you the ipad screen as well so that you will understand better and now i have already updated my ipad to the latest 18.0 let me just show you from the settings so you can see that it's on the 18.0 ipad 7 generation Now next iPad will ask you to trust the device so click on that. Now next you can use the command for the rootless or rootful mode. For this video I am using the rootless so let me just uh, adjust the terminal size so now it's okay. So now I will type the Pelrain give space and hyphen L for the rootless and then just hit on enter. And after that you will see your iPad will directly go into the recovery mode. So just wait for it. Now it's here. If the iTunes pop up, just close it. Now next on the terminal, press enter key. And after that you have to put your device into the DFU mode. Or you can follow the instruction on the screen. It will give you the same. So press and hold the buttons according to your device. Now you can see the Pelrin jailbreak process has been started. Now just wait for it to get complete. So now you can see the device is booting up and the terminal is quit automatically and in some device it will stay on the booting so don't worry about that. Once the spell rain and the booting is completed that means you are done and after that you can close the terminal. So let's wait for the device to get boot up on the home screen. Alright so it's done. Now you can disconnect the cable. So let me just open the iPad. Now next on the home screen you will get the Pelrin loader icon. Sometime it will take some seconds or a minute. Make sure you connect it with the internet or Wi-Fi. After that you will see the Pelrin loader on your home screen. So let's wait. Now you can see it's here. Now let's open it. You will get the two default package manager that comes with the spell rain. One is the Celio and other one is the Zebra. If you go to the utilities and about section, you will see the root list and the other information. You can respring the device from there, from the utilities and there are other options you can check it out. So just to show you guys, I will install this Celio package manager. Now let me just close the terminal. Now you can see it's uh, downloading some package manager files. Let's wait for it. Now here it asking to set any root password as per your choice. You can set any password you want. For now I am typing sudo. So now it's done. You will see Celio on your home screen. Just open it. Alright so here we are, we have successfully jailbreak the latest iOS 18.0 with the Pelrain jailbreak on my iPad 7 generation. This is the only iPad that support the iOS 18 with the Pelrain jailbreak. You can update all the required packages so that you will get the smooth jailbreak experience. Okay, so now it's done. Also, you need to install one tweak from the Elite Kit. Just install this tweak as this is important for some tweaks to work properly. So simply install it and after that just respring your iPad. Do not reboot it. Simply go back and go to the Pelerin Loader, Utilities and just restart Spring Boot.
now everything is set just open the serial loader again and everything looks good we have updated all the required packages and that tweak is also installed so everything looks good so far and sometimes Celio may crash so you can just reopen it and then it will cut so that's how you can jailbreak with a spell ring jailbreak latest version on the ios 18 with this only supported ipad that is the ipad 7 generation and this is the semi theater jailbreak so if you reboot the device you have to re-jailbreak it again with the same way so that is all for today's video session i hope you gained some knowledge and enjoying my content if yes just hit the like button on this video and if you are new here please subscribe to my channel for more cool updates like this i will see you in another video so till then goodbye take care and peace out